Hello friends, it's Miss Shacklin here with Baby Bookworms and we're going to be celebrating all about the library because this is actually um, National Library Week and of course babies love the library. I know you may have missed the library in this past year because of the pandemic but do come into the children's room. Um, we don't have programs yet in person but you can most certainly bring your babies in so they can explore and see all the board books and have lots of fun and we do have take and make crafts as well so definitely feel free to come visit us because we have missed you all right so we're gonna get started and just so you know my friend today that i'm gonna be using is gonna be our baby bookworm mascot because you, can, you can't have this without a bookworm all right you guys ready to say hello to everybody so say hello miss jacqueline hello baby bookworm and say hello to everybody at home all right you ready Hello, Miss Jacqueline. Hello, Mr. Bookworm. Hello, everybody. It's time to say hello. Yay. Good job. All right, now that we've said hello to everybody, we're going to do our hands are clapping song. So we clap our hands, we tap our toes, we blink our eyes, we wiggle our nose, and we do babies hiding which is usually their favorite. <laughs> All right, you ready? Hands, hands, hands are clapping. Hands, hands, hands are clapping. Hands, hands, hands are clapping. Clap your hands, my baby. Good job. Now we're gonna do our toes. Toes, toes, toes are tapping. Toes, toes, toes are tapping. Toes, toes, toes are tapping. Tap your toes, my baby. Good job. All right, now we're gonna do our eyes. Eyes, eyes, eyes are blinking. Eyes, eyes, eyes are blinking. Eyes, eyes, eyes are blinking. Blink your eyes, my baby. Now let's do our nose. <clears throat> nose, nose, nose is wiggling. Nose, nose, nose is wiggling. Nose, nose, nose is wiggling. Wiggle your nose, my baby. Good job, now we're gonna do our last one. Baby, baby, baby is hiding. Baby, baby, baby is hiding. Baby, baby, baby is hiding. Peekaboo, my baby. Yay! Great job, everybody. All right. Now that we've done our hands are clapping song, we should bring the sun out so that we can have a nice sunny day today. So get your Mr. Sun ready. Oh, Mr. Sun, sun. Mr. Golden Sun, please shine down on me. Oh, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun, hiding behind a tree. These little children are asking you to please come out so we can play with you. Oh, Mr. Sun, Sun, Mr. Golden Sun, please shine down on me. Yay! Good job. Now the sun is out and we are ready to have some fun. <laughs> so our first rhyme we're gonna do is a bounce rhyme. <clears throat> so feel free to get your buddy, your buddy, <laughs> your baby ready to bounce. Again, it's whatever is comfortable for whatever stage of development they are. And we're gonna do it to with our baby bookworm here. So I bounce you here. I bounce you there. I bounce you, bounce you everywhere. I tickle you here. I tickle you there. I tickled you, tickle you everywhere. I hug you here. I hug you there. I hug you, hug you everywhere. Yay. Good job. Again, some babies are more ticklish than others. Some babies love the hugging part. It is whatever is comfortable for you and your baby. All right, now that we've tickled, hugged, and gotten ready, we're going to do our some scarf songs. And if you've done these with me before, you'll know that at home, feel free to use whatever scarf you have available. It could even be a piece of fabric. Um, again, it's the sensory aspect that we're looking for. 
color recognition so if you do have something that's colorful that's always nice as well again we understand if you don't have the specific scars like we have here at the library um, but we can work with whatever you have <laughs> all right so are you guys ready we're gonna do um, if you're happy and you know it read a book because it's library week and every week we should be reading a book every day we should be reading a book all right you ready if you're happy if you're happy and you know it, read a book. If you're happy and you know it, read a book. If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show it. If you're happy and you know it, read a book. Oh, I, now we have to turn the page. You guys ready? If you're happy and you know it, turn the page. Woo! If you're happy and you know it, turn the page. If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show it, if you're happy and you know, turn the page. Woo! Good job. All right. If you're happy and you know it, check out some books. <gasps> Got to come home with you. If you're happy and you know it, check out some books. Woo! If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show it, if you're happy and you know it, check out some books. Ooh, you can check them out and take them all home with you. <laughs> awesome job, guys. Now, this one, again, feel free to use a scarf with it, but also feel free to do some of like the hand movements with it too. Um, I'll be trying to do my best to do a combo. And this one is called, If You're a Reader and You Know It. So we did, if you're happy and you know it, read a book. But now we're going to do, if you're a reader and you know it. If you're a reader and you know it, clap your hands. If you're a reader and you know it, clap your hands. If you're a reader and you know it and you really want to show it. If you're a reader and you know it, clap your hands. Good job, we clapped our hands. And again, feel free, even if your baby is not at the stage where they're able to clap their hands, um, moving their hands together with your own is just as important as it is for them when they learn how to do it on their own as they get older. All right, our next one is gonna be shout hooray, you ready? If you're a reader and you know it, shout hooray, hooray! If you're a reader and you know it, shout hooray, hooray! If you're a reader and you know it and you really wanna show it, if you're a reader and you know it, shout hooray, hooray! Yay! Good job. So I kind of added some more lyrics to that one, but instead of being just about um, a book, it's also about being a reader because you have to have one. You can't have one without the other. <laughs> All right. So we're going to do our last scarf song, which is going to be read, read, read a book, which is to the tune of row, row, row your boat. So read, read, read a book, travel anywhere. Worldwide, you decide a book will take you there. Read, read, read a book beginning to the end. What a way to spend the day. A book's a special friend. And yeah, I have some books with me. I, Miss Jacqueline, I love books. I love reading books with our babies and with our toddlers, with all ages. Um, and I hope you guys enjoy all the different books that we have here to offer. Um, are you guys ready to do a little counting rhyme with me with books? We're going to put our scarf away for now. And Miss Jacqueline's going to bring our books to the front. Alrighty. And if you'll see, Miss Jacqueline has one, two, three, four, five books. So we're going to do a five little book rhyme. Five little books sitting in a pile. Oh, look inside one. And there's a crocodile. All right, so we're gonna read this one. So we're gonna take him off. All right, four little books, all in a pile, all standing straight in single file. So we're gonna read this book next. Oh, and we only have three left. Three little books sitting on the shelf. Can you take one and read it for yourself? I think I'll take this one and we'll read it and see what it's about. All right, two little books left on the pile. Find one now and read it with a smile. Look, he's even smi this book's even smiling himself. 
Good job. All right, there's only one little book left. One little book. That's all there is. Found itself a reader who is happy to share. <gasps> Look how happy he is that he found somebody to read him. He's so happy. Yay! So we, we have no more books left because we've been reading them all. All right, let's put them back so we can count how many we have. We've got one, two, three, four, and we can't for, forget the one with the crocodile, five. Good job counting with me, guys. You did such a good job. All righty. <clears throat> We're going to do our last bounce rhyme which if you feel comfortable lifting up your baby, we will do that one. And then we'll do our goodbye song. All right, but baby bookworm, he needs his glasses, he's ready. Well, now you're gonna have to lift your baby first and then you can kind of shake gently and then bring them down and give them a kiss. That's, those are all the movements, so. Away up high in the apple tree, I saw a little baby smiling at me. I shook that tree as hard as I could. Down came the baby. Mmm, that was good. Mwah. <laughs> we'll just try that one more time. Away up high in the apple tree, I saw a little baby smiling at me. I shook the tree as hard as I could. Down came the baby. Mmm, she was good. <laughs> good job. I know all the babies, they're so tasty because they're so cute. All right, I hope you guys had fun celebrating libraries with me this week, and we're going to do our open shut them song. Um, just keep in mind, coming up um, in May, we are going to take a short break from Baby Bookworms so that I can get ready the Baby Bookworms that we're going to be um, virtual for the summer. So keep that in mind. All right, you guys ready? Open shut them, open shut them, them give a little clap 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 open shut them open shut them put them in your lap 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 wave them wave them wave them wave them high up in the sky 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 i'll wave to you you'll wave to me let's all say bye 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 everybody see you next time